everyone, it's Miss Kelly and Miss Kay from the Mifflin County Library. We're here today on, I don't know about in your house, but it's a snowy day here at the library. It sure is. We're here to tell you some snowy stories. Before we get started, let's sing our story time song. Get your hands ready and we're gonna clap and sing. You ready? Let's all clap because our friends are here, friends are here, friends are here. Let's all clap because our friends are here, here for story time. Hi friends, so glad you joined us today. Me too. So today's story is called The Snowy Day. Look, there's a little boy sliding down a snowy hill. Let's find out what happens on this snowy day. One morning, Peter woke up and he looked out the window. Snow had fallen during the night. It covered everything as far as he could see. See everything outside of his window? It's so pretty. Covered in snow. All white. It is all white. After breakfast, he put on his snowsuit and ran outside. The snow was piled up very high along the street to make a path for walking. That snow is so high, it's, it's taller than he is. Wow. Crunch, crunch, crunch. His feet sank in the snow. He walked, pointing his toes out like this. see our feet on our video, but if you take your feet and you point your toes out, then you can walk out. That looks a little bit like how a penguin walks. It does. Oh, and then he walked with his toes pointing in. So that's like this, like that. And look, he's made footprints with his toes pointing in. Love to make footprints in the snow. Mm -hmm. He dragged his feet slowly to make tracks and he found something sticking out of the snow and that made a new track. Look, you see where his feet were dragging? There are two lines and then he found his something and now there are three lines. I wonder what that something was. It's a very long stick that made that nice, made a nice track. But that stick was just right for smacking a snow-covered tree. Oh my goodness. Uh-oh. Look at him. Down fell the snow, plop, right on top of Peter's head. Hmm. Peter shook that snow off and now he's just walking away making more footprints i love to make footprints in the snow me too he thought it would be fun to join the big boys for a snowball fight Ooh, that sounds fun but he knew he wasn't old enough not yet so he made a smiling snowman Oh, look at that smile on that snowman. Have you made a snowman this year? I have a snowman at my house. And he made angels. Oh, snow angels. Snow Those are fun. angels. He laid down in the snow. Can you make your arms do that like a snow angel? Wave your arms up and down and wave your legs in and out. That's so fun. He pretended he was a mountain climber and he climbed way up the great big tall heaping mountain of snow and then he slid all the way down the other side that looks like fun it does look like a lot of fun he picked up a handful of snow and another and still another he packed it round and firm and put the snowball in his pocket. 
for tomorrow. Then he went into his warm hut. Inside, he told his mother all about his adventures while she took off his wet socks. I don't think he has too many clothes on right now, does he? He must have all been wet and cold. And he thought and thought and thought about them. Look, he's getting a nice warm bath. I love a warm bath. And he After thought about all of his snow. adventures. Oh, that's he fun. He did, he did. Before he got into bed, he looked in his coat pocket, but his pocket was empty. The snowball wasn't there. My goodness, what do you think happened to that snowball? I don't know, but Peter felt very sad. If you took a cold snowball, a cold, wet snowball into your house, in a rainstorm, what might happen to it? You're right, it would melt. But look, Peter's sleeping. While he slept, he dreamed that the sun had melted all the snow away. Oh no, I'm not ready for that, are you? But when he woke up, his dream was gone. The snow was still everywhere and new snow was falling. After breakfast, he called to his friend from across the hall, and they went out together into the deep, deep snow. Look how tiny they are, and look, look how, how high. high that snow is. Look how pretty that snow is. That looks yeah. like it's going to be a great day for a snow adventure. I think it looked like fun. Do you want to take adventures out in the snow? And drag your feet like Peter. Do you know, Miss Kelly and I, have had a few adventures outside in the snow recently. Yeah. It's been very fun. Yep. I love being outside in the snow, but when you go outside, Miss Kay, you really need to bundle up to stay warm. You do. I like to wear something on my head. Oh, is it a hat? I like to wear a hat. Oh, I like to wear a hat too. And I like to wear something on my hands. Are they gloves or mm -hmm. maybe mittens? Yes, to keep my hands nice and toasty. I likes to wear something that zips up right here. A nice warm coat. That's my favorite. And I hope something on your feet to keep your feet nice and warm. Maybe. Some nice warm boots. Yes. You know what's really fun about my boots, Miss K? What's fun? When I walk in the snow, I have snowflake prints <gasps> that are made from my boots. I saw them when we were outside the other day. That's so pretty. I know, it's so fun. I love to look at my prints whenever I'm in the snow. It makes me happy. Do you think we could sing a song? I think we could sing a song. About all of the things that we wear outside in the snow. I think we could. Do you know the hokey pokey? I do. We're gonna do the winter pokey. Yep. Are you ready? Let's start with our Gloves. gloves. Let's start with our gloves. Put your gloves in, you put your gloves out, you put your gloves in, and you shake them all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. What should we do next? I think let's put our hat in. Let's put our hat in. Are you ready? You put, put your hat in, you put your hat out, you put your hat in, and you shake it all about. You do the winter pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Can we put our boots in? Let's put our boots in. Put your boots in. You put your boots out. You put your boots in and you shake them all about. You do the winter pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Should we do our coat? Let's do our coat. Let's do our coat. Put, put your, your coat in, you, you put, put your coat out, you put your coat in, and you shake it all about. You do the winter pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. That was perfect. That was very fun. That helps warm you up when you're outside in the cold, in too. In the cold, so if you're outside playing and you get cold, just sing the winter pokey. Do it. It's a lot of fun, and it warms you up. I think so. Do you think, before we go, Miss Kay, we could sing popcorn kernels with our friends. I think we could, but I think we have a fun, different way to sing popcorn Ooh, kernels today. Do you see what we have sitting on our couch? 
you know what this is? This is, it looks like Peter Snowball. They gathered up some snow and packed it really tight. They made a snowball. It's not a real snowball though. This snowball is made out of yarn. It's not gonna melt all over the place. It won't. Well, Miss K made us some fun snowballs. So we would have snowballs for story time today. Do you have something that you can toss like a snowball? Or maybe you can still use your scarf. Are you ready? Let's see popcorn kernels. Let's see it. You ready? Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in the pot, in the pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them till they pop, till they pop. That was wonderful. That was great. Do you think, Miss K, we can teach our friends at home a goodbye song? Oh, I think we could. Let's. let's we have a fun goodbye song. We do. You need your hands again, just like when we clapped in the beginning. You're and just clap. like at the beginning, we're gonna clap funny up and down like we're this. We're gonna clap. And can you wave? Can you wave? And one more. This one might be a little tricky, but it's super fun to learn. You do it with your eye. And I wink. Just close one, one eye. eye and wink. Are you ready? Let's do for a goodbye song. Oh, it's time to say goodbye to all our friends. Oh, it's time to 